For cattle producers in the state, the market is reaching an all-time high after rough winters. Many ranchers say they needed this. Maya Fleck is here to tell us more about cattle prices. Maya? Yes, the American Farm Bureau reported that cattle prices have changed a lot in 2023. The weighted average market price for a steer this July was 27% higher than it was in July 2022. These higher prices are good for the ranchers in the state. West Frederick ranches near Flasher and he says it's been the best price since around 10 years ago. This year it looks to be as good or, or better and, and probably for next year and the year after. We are happen to be at a good place in the cattle cycle as well as just all-time beef cattle cow inventory numbers being low. So those two things coming together at the same time are creating an environment for uh, us cow-calf people to have a chance to you know make some money, pay some bills. A year he won't forget. Feed supplies are good. Um, we're enjoying uh, record rainfalls here in the area of Grant County that we're in. So the hay yards are full, silage piles are huge, and uh, pastures were good throughout the growing season. A lot of ranchers needed a good year. We go back to, in the last 10 years, you know, we've had, you know, two really dry years. We've had sell-offs. We've had a couple springs that were real tough calving. Kiss says everyone is a little more cautious because last time it was supposed to be good for a long time. He says he wishes it wasn't so volatile with the ups and downs in the market and the weather. Even though the market is good, high cattle prices can pose other issues. But then, you know, everybody in between's got to make money and the, the consumer's got to afford the product, you know. So that's a concern, you know, and, you know, to compete with the cheaper meats. He says he hopes it all works and the market stays good for ranchers because it's supply and demand. This year, high input costs also remain an issue. There are 2.24 cattle per people in the state of North Dakota.